Last week, we revealed the magical powers of hot verbal dirty talk. And this week, we have four fun ways to develop your dirty talk seductive superpower, including one key factor that will electrify your lover. This week on The Blue Ball Report, I'm your host, Superfuck, and the topic of the day is dirty talk. Let's get started, and we'll count down to the most powerful verbals who will evolve. At number four, first, you must be willing to embrace discomfort. All new skills feel uncomfortable until we master them, especially regarding sex. But there are ways to make it less uncomfortable, like number three, practice alone. First, jot down the words and phrases that turn you on. Reading or writing erotica is a great inspiration. Then, while masturbating, try out that dirty talk until it feels comfortable and authentic coming from your own mouth. Think of it like learning a new language. It takes practice. Number two, partner practice. Try practicing with a trusted partner who is down for dirty talk. A great way to start is with a fun game. Buy or make a set of dirty talk refrigerator magnets like the ones here. Link in the description below. To start, each of you gets to remove any words that you would find unacceptable under any circumstances. It's good to know each other's trigger words so you don't stumble upon them. I mean, who wants to ever hear the word prick? Or the C word in the bedroom? Not me. No shame at all, just not my thing. After you remove the words that are off limits, you might want to add some of your own. I love the word jammer, stud plugger, man rammer. Then what you'll do is you'll each take turns creating sentences for the other person to say. Maybe even during play. No matter how ridiculous it is, you'll try different ways to say it until your partner says, that's hot. And then you get to guess whether or not your partner seriously thought the phrase was hot or was it a joke. You both win the game getting to practice your verbal communication and getting to know each other. And to demonstrate this great game, I brought in a very special guest, beaming to you live via hologram from the planet Gonad, one of my favorite play partners, Jenny from the blockchain. Hi, I'm Jenny, I'm blonde. Hi Jenny, how you doing? My hairdo is called Freshly Fucked. Sure, I'll play with you, Super Fuck. Let's play this game. I love games. Okay, Jenny, let's see. There we go. Plug my nasty gaping bitch hole. All right, super fuck. Talk dirty to me. Oh yeah, come sit on daddy's muff. Come sit on daddy's muff. Ew, stop picking your nose, super fuck. Besides, I have an update to make it even hotter. Hmm, get over here and sit on daddy's tool. Where are your face in my bush? Oh yeah, jam that bro hole. Oh yeah, slurp my back door, slurp it. Slurp, slurp my back door. Come smell daddy's bowl scent. <laughs> Finally, we've arrived at the moment you've been waiting for, the number one tool in the shed of hot verbal dirty talk. The truth is, it's actually more about the nonverbals than it is the words that you use. Sounds ironic, I know, but it's more about the authenticity, the passion, the confidence, and that's all expressed through your body language, your facial expressions, your tone, your command of the sexiness of the moment. And all of that comes with practice. I'm gonna add one added bonus tip today. There's a reason why I call it play and not performance. If you think about it in terms of being playful, it's easier and less pressure than if you think about it in terms of a performance. So it's good to look at your sex life as a play life. It's adult play. Well, you have plenty to practice this week, but honestly, this is just the tip of the iceberg for developing your bedroom voice, included in my new online workshop, Me Talk Dirty One Day. If you're interested in finding out more about online workshop offerings, about this skill and other skills from your favorite superhero, find a link in the description to find out more information. We've come to the end of the episode, my friends, but I'd love to get your advice on what we should talk about in future episodes of the Blue Ball Report. Please add your ideas in the comments below. I'm your host, Superfuck. Until next time, farewell and fuck well.